want to take an opportunity to thank all of you who were able to make one of our campaign receptions. We had seven receptions in total. We spread them out so that people could get an opportunity to come at their convenience. If you are not able to make one of the receptions, we'll have more information available in packets after Mass this coming weekend. If you're not here, we can mail one out to you. I wanted to take an opportunity in this vlog to share some different experiences of our own parishioners and their own sense of the campaign. We put together early on a campaign committee that is really helping us journey through every step of this process. So I invite you now to listen to some of our campaign committee members and their reflections upon our parish and upon the goal and task ahead of us. I'm Emily Carl. My husband Kevin and I have been parishioners at Holy Spirit for just about a year. Um, we have two children, a six-year-old and a three-year-old, who love to run laps after donuts after mass. Uh, we have really found community here at Holy Spirit, uh, so we joined the campaign committee to make sure that the community of Holy Spirit stays strong and we continue to have our community and others can grow in um, their faith and with the community that we've grown to love also. Hi, my name is Mike Gallagher and uh, my wife Chris and I and our daughter Kate and our son Thomas are members here at Holy Spirit Church. Um, our families were members here as well, and um, so we've been around Holy Spirit Church our entire life. Um, our, our children went through Holy Spirit School and uh, attended Shanley High School, and, and uh, one has graduated and one's a senior this year. Um, we've been involved with uh, Holy Spirit Church, um, I would say a lot more since our children started attending Holy Spirit School uh, about 10, 10, 12 years ago. And... Uh, that really got us involved more, uh, I think, in our faith and in the church um, because our kids were coming home from school and bringing home information of what they learned about their faith, and we as parents um, were inspired to learn more ourselves. Um, it really helped us through some rocky times as a family uh, about 10 years ago. Um, we, we went uh, through a period of uh, recovery and discovery and uh, some hard times for a few years. And um, our, our community here at Holy Spirit um, Church and Holy Spirit School, um, our friends and, and, uh, and uh, staff and, and others um, really helped us through that time. And um, so we have a lot of gratitude uh, towards Holy Spirit Church and school for, for what they've done for us and for our family and the life that we have today. So Chris and I uh, support the capital campaign here uh, financially and uh, in spirit. Um, I've been involved with the Finance Council for uh, several years and so I've been involved with Father Ross uh, on the background and planning this uh, campaign and the, and the building projects. Um, we, we have benefited from the generosity of those that had the courage 70 years ago to build this school and this church. And uh, through the generosity of many people over the last 70 years, we've been able to maintain um, the building and the congregation. Um, and we have greatly benefited from that ourselves. And so this is a time for us and for everybody um, to uh, step up and help support the church during this um, important project in the life of the church. The project, uh, replacement of the heating system up for the school and the church, um, it's reached its uh, end of its lifespan, so we need to replace that. Um, the school, of course, has had um, some structural issues in the past six months, and so that reconstruction is underway. Um, we greatly want to get the kids back into school here at Holy Spirit, because the school is so important to the life of this church and the families that, that it brings. My name is Isaac Shun. Uh, my wife, Corey, and our family uh, have been parishioners here at Holy Spirit for eight to nine years. Uh, we joined Holy Spirit um, about six to eight months after we moved back uh, to North Dakota from Rochester. We just really, um, at the time, uh, fell in love with the people we interacted with as well as uh, certainly it was close to our home and in our neighborhood. Um, we've been active in the parish over those eight to nine years and have really 
uh, grown relationships with, with fellow parishioners. Uh, as it relates to this capital campaign, uh, our family feels strongly that this, this church is our, our faith home. Uh, our fellow parishioners are our, our faith family. In full support of this campaign, uh, we have made our uh, sacrificial gift and commitment uh, and just really would encourage you uh, as our fellow parishioners, as our, our fellow family members, uh, to prayerfully consider a sacrificial gift um, on behalf of your family, but on behalf of your neighbors and friends too, so we can all enjoy our parish for years to come. The, the church is important to the people of North, North Side of Fargo, and uh, we greatly ask you to uh, help us and to join Chris and I in support of this project. Uh, so Kevin and I would like to invite all parishioners to participate in the campaign so we can continue our vibrant community here at Holy Spirit.